What is going on everybody? My name is Deepat and welcome to another quick quick video. I'm just going to explain to you guys how to get Age of Engineering, pretty much any mod pack, using uh, into MultiMC as the new Twitch app. This thing is goddamn stupid. I cannot get anything but my mods. Oh, okay, and occasionally some other ones now. There's some more showing up now, which is still good, but it's still really bad. Like, it's... It's really bad, like nothing is showing up. If I go to 1.10.2, nothing. Well, get rid of it. It's only showing what I've got installed and a couple other ones. It is really annoying. So, Multi MC is a managed Minecraft instances with E like program. It's pretty much to, uh, the Twitch app, the new Twitch app, but it's it's better in other words. And I just hit my microphone. I apologize. Um, I keep looking up because I've just got my screen up there now. So I'm not going over here like this when I'm looking at things. It's, I don't know. I thought it might be a little bit better. So we'll see. Anyway, so let's get straight into this. Multi MC. To download Multi MC, you come over to this website. Uh, link will be in the description below. Um, click Multi. Uh, click download and install. Obviously, select your preferred thingy: Windows, Mac, or Linux. Um, I've already downloaded it all, so I'm not going to bother. But once you've downloaded it. Um, it will be in a WinRAR file, so let's, uh, this one, uh, bring that over to this one, it will look like this, alright, all you need to do is drag that file onto wherever you want, I've got it onto my desktop here, um, and you're pretty much good to go, so, you open it up, once again on the other screens, Open up multicraftmc.exe. You can also send this to desktop if you wish. I might actually do that because it'll probably be easier than keep going in the folder. Then you don't have to have that folder on your desktop. You can have it wherever you want. Close that out. Now, I've already got Age of uh, Engineering in here because I've already done it. And I'm currently actually on it right now, as you can see. So I'm going to do it with a different, uh, a different one so I can add it into here. So what we're going to do is we're going to go back to this. So I've got Age of Engineering here. Um, I'm actually going to change this. Let's go Mod Packs. <laughs> I'm doing it right now for you, well, but um, and I'm going to add all ver. Let's just go all versions 1.10.2 popularity. All right, so I'm going to add. Hmm. 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 Let's go Sky Factory because I've already got. We've got a server running that. I may as well add it on here. It doesn't want to search for it. That's pretty cool. Uh, browse projects. What am I doing? I'm so confused right now. All right, let's just skip. It. Let's just do this one. All right, Age of Engineering. You want to click this button here, Age of Engineering, the latest version. Select the latest version and click the download button. Once that is finished downloading, you are gonna open it. You're gonna open it and bam, here you are. Next, this is a very important thing. This is a very important thing to do with this. Um, you need to come up to this button here, change settings. You need to go into multi MC and update channel. Yours will look like stable. You have to click development and then click close and then click this button here, the update button. I've already done mine, so I can't do it again. It will come up with a section saying development preview update. You click the update button and it will then relaunch and you'll be in the development up here you'll see version point zero point six development blah 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 next you're going to want to go to this button here new instance click import mod pack or local file all right sorry i just had to click do something um where were we we were adding the file that's all right all right so next you want to find where you downloaded it to so for me it is in a separate file and we're going to go to downloads and I've just added all the mods just so I can actually show you how to do it. Um, you want to leave it as the zip file and you want to click then click open. This will only work if you're in development mode. If you're not in development mode, it will say uh, pack not having an instance or something like that. Um, and then go back to what I just did before and change it into development mode up the top here. Cool. We'll click OK. It's extracting mod pack. Let's let this go through. 
All right, now, as you can see, I've had added it here, and then all you know you need to do is double click, and it will start playing and launching up. Now, I do not want to do it because I've already got a Minecraft launched. Cool. Now, I did forget to do one thing at the start. So what you want to do when you first log in, um, it will tell you down here you've got no account somewhere. So you just click on Manage Accounts, go to Accounts, click Add, put in your normal Minecraft username and password, and click OK, and then you've got your account. You can also select over here, Java. You can select the maximum memory allocation, the minimum memory allocation, where your Java actually is in case it's selected in a different path as mine is, it's on a separate hard drive. Um, and then Minecraft, what your width is when it launches. Other than that, um, that's pretty much all we need to do. Um, I can make this dark close. Ooh, nice, dark. I like dark. I like everything dark. Anyway, that's pretty much it for this. I uh, hope it was helpful. Um, you can do this for any of them. I don't know what this little X means. Instance all the mods packs. I don't know. Maybe that means I'm playing that and that one's closed. I don't bloody know. Anyway, I hope this helped and hope you're able to get the mod pack sorted. In the description below is a link to Multi MC and also Tim Revolt's page, Tim Revolt's Discord, Tim Revolt's TeamSpeak, um, and the IPs for all of our Minecraft servers. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked this video and it was helpful, click that like. Where's my camera? Click that like button. Uh, also click the big subscribe button down the bottom the big one uh, actually it's at the top somewhere in it somewhere around there uh, to see more videos thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next chapter I can never ever find the right words and there's no way this is real life there's no telling you're the right girl so I can only say that it feels right it feels right it feels right yeah I can only say that it feels